Hey guys, welcome back. Okay. Continuing on with our Fallout very hard. Let's play. And yes, I have more coffee. Alright. So it's early. We're still working on stuff. We gotta go to Concord. We gotta go get... Yeah. Yeah, let's just go get that done. Man. Eh. Hmm. I always build there. Okay, let's let's get something for them to move into before we go to Concord. Uh, let me see. Scrap it up. What the Yeah, just remember, all this stuff counts against your build budget, so... Now what you can do... You might consider cheating, or metagaming, or... Whatever dirty word somebody wants to try to attach to it. But there are resources out there that tell you... The... Uh, spawn points for the baddies who will spawn to attack your settlements. And if you want, you can you can set it up so that your defenses are basically clustered around those spawn points and of course that makes defending a hell of a lot easier. Now you may think that's cheating, you may you may call it metagaming. Eh, maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. I don't I don't know. I personally don't do it. But in a single player game, I don't condemn people for, you know, aka cheating in multiplayer competitive games. Sure, I hate cheaters. But in Fallout 4, when you're playing by yourself, come on. You're really going to get all bent out of shape because somebody, uh, air, you know, air quotes, cheated. You know, I'm not. No. Doesn't really interest me. Although I'm beginning to wonder if I have the time to run two Let's Play series at the same time concurrently. I may have to let one go. And that would probably be the Mech Warrior one. But the Mech Warrior one just got really interesting. <laughs> I got a great mech. And. I kind of sort of want to drive that mech at least a few times before hanging it up, you know. Okay, let's do something about all the chairs and such and whatnot. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if you very carefully place the targeting... See, I stored that. I'm gonna store that. I'll delete that. Well, not delete it, but... Hey, lighter. Give me some oil. Yarst. I don't know what that means. I was gonna say yes. And it came out yarst. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I'm doing it. Scrap all this up. Now there's nothing that says you have to do this, okay? I choose to do it. Because I think building settlements is fun. If you don't, then you should skip it. Without a doubt. Let me get that ammo. What we got here? Ooh. Perfecto mundo. Now, just so you know, these things don't respawn, so there's really no, there's no point in leaving them. At least not to my knowledge. I've, I've never seen them respawn. Bing. 
Man, I missed the music. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna get the the basics of this settlement going. And uh Ooh, concrete. Very useful early game. Couch. Ah, shit. Um. Is that... That is placeable. Okay. We'll go ahead and store that in the workshop. Okay. Okay. Right. Oh. Pipe pistol. I don't think we need that. We've got a bunch of pipe pistols. Alright. Should have uh, looted that. Oh, there we go. Hey, what's that? Cigarette cartons. There we go. Yeah, I need that. Thought there was a safe around here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Get us some plastic. Store that in the workshop. All right, let's open up that safe. Safe. If I can not break a bobby pin. Come on. There you go. Nice. Alright, what do we got? Yeah. That'll work. And now we can break the safe down. I think this will get us a spring screws. That's good. That's good. Oh, what's that? Glass. Yes, please. I think that just about does it. Okay, so let's get this ready. See, normally I build here. But I'm going to do it a little different this time. Is dog meat with me? He's unassigned. He's not following me. Hmm. Okay. So. Yeah, that, that always throws my plans off. Okay. Now. I'm gonna show you how I build, and I have a I have a video on this. I call it the wedding cake design. I'm not saying it's perfect, but this is the way I like to do things. And what I do is I try to get this about right. Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. Screwed up. Okay, store. I'll pick this up. Okay. And now we'll just kind of look and see where we are. And I just adjust it. And I get it roughly even with the... It's really important to get this first piece right. Because if you don't, it'll throw the rest of your build off. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. That'll be fine. That'll be just fine. Now, you can do this different ways, okay? You can just build on this, okay? You could put down a bunch of shack floors, uh, and that's fine. But you need a you, you need a snap point, right? And then I like 
these guys right here. And this is pretty much the basis of my of my building style. And if you do it this way, it'll line up correctly, right? Now we can also do the flat one. Where's the flat one? No, no, there isn't a flat one with the... That's flat, but I like the windows. All right? And see, if you do it this way, then you can watch how I can just walk this right down the line. Well, until I get to there. Hmm. How did I do that last time? Hmm. That's not what I want. Alright. Let's do it differently. But I don't think that's going to work. Hmm. Hmm. What is going on? Hmm. So that's usually what I do. Hmm. Maybe I want to do it different this time. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm. Oh, that's probably what I did. Oh, I think I know. Okay. Let's line it up here. Okay, how we doing? We are way off. <laughs> hmm? Okay. Now how we doing? Eh, better. That might be why I always build over at the other site. see what's going on. Hmm. How off is that? Just a smidge. Hmm. Yes, it looks... Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> okay, better. Better? Eh. Probably good enough for jazz. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, that will work. Now we can start doing the wedding cake. I think it'll go. Will it go? No. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Sometimes this will snap and sometimes it won't. There it goes. I am content. Alright. And now you can do this in different ways. Um, one thing you could do is you could drop a prefab right there, but I think that throws off the the alignment with the roof. I think 
Let me see. See if we drop a prefab right there. Now, how does the shack floor upper set? Does it snap correctly or does it mess up? Hmm. Yeah, see how the height's off? Look at that. Let's see, this way you get a kind of ceiling effect right here. But what I like to do is put stores down here. Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to do this. Hmm. I didn't. I didn't run those correctly. It's easier to do the lighting if the if the uh, slats or whatever the fuck they're called. If they all run the same direction. Come on. Get in there. You bastard. Okay. Yeah, and see this way, with not putting a floor here, I can put a vendor right there. And I want at least two, if not three, vendors in here eventually. Yeah, okay. So we'll... Wait a minute. Okay, where my stairs gonna go up? Right... There? Yeah. Okay. So... This is the easiest stair to put in. But it takes up a lot of room. I prefer when I can to do a omnidirectional stair if it'll if it'll fit it will and I do one going each way because the NPCs they just love to block your stairways I mean they just love it and so you can see what's going on here Hmm. Look at what that prefab did. That seems like a waste of material. It's not turned the right way. There we go. Okay. So this first floor is more for um, scavenging stations, or this might just be my marketplace, and I'll the scavenging stations over there. Uh, if you want, you could put in a prefab right here. If you wanted it to make to make it appear more, um, let's just say structurally sound, instead of floating in the air like this. Uh, I guess it, it just depends on how much that matters to you. It doesn't really matter to me, but you know. Something like that. Okay, so then what we need is a second floor. And with the wedding cake design, the second floor is, if you'll pardon the pun, a snap. There's nothing to it. It just takes a few moments to get the second floor up. And this is where we'll put all the beds. And we've already got six beds, so... And you see I leveled. And now we can get idiot savant. Like we should have in the first place when we screwed up. Okay. And now we can we will get more XP much more quickly. Yeah. 
You want to be careful you don't spam this down too quickly. Because we're going to want to get Red Rocket going. And then Abernathy. Post haste. And if we blow all of our resources here, of course that'll be fewer resources to get those settlements going. So, but right now I think we're fine. And you can see how quickly this this comes together. But some folks don't consider this fun. I get that. I think it's kind of, kind of it's, it's at least kind of fun. And it's very productive. Because once you get these settlers really producing for you with, you know, 10, 12 scavenging stations and and everybody's making uh, the correct f uh, food and cranking out extra purified water. I mean, this... <laughs> you will get rich quick doing this. You really will. And I think for now... That's probably how I'll leave it. And there we are. And now for defense, what I like to do is early game, it's all about. Nope, oh, that's the wrong thing. Here we go. Early game's all about the um, to me anyway. It's let me get this on there straight. Yeah, there we go. It's all about the oh oh I see, uh, okay that does look kind of dumb. Hmm. Yeah, but that's where I want them. Hmm. What can I get away with here? Hmm. I'll put them up there. Heavy machine gun turrets. Those are your best friends early game. And then mid to late game, rocket launchers. Combination of rocket launchers and heavy machine gun turrets is what you want. Right. Do -do 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 -do. And I think we can make one or two. I think. I'm not sure if we have access to heavy machine gun turrets yet. Yes, we do. We can make one. <laughs> we don't have enough circuitry. And there we go. All right. Yeah, let's... So he's protected from melee attacks. What you doing, dog meat? Okay. Let's save. And we'll go to Conquered. How many rounds do I have? Yeah, plenty. Is my pack full? I doubt it. That would be a big negative. <laughs> Ten rounds. I'm carrying a couple of pike pistols I really don't need. I wonder if I can... upgrade this ten. Probably shouldn't bother. Nah, hit the wrong button. Let's see here. Let's 
put all of our junk in here. Let's see here. Nah, yeah, I don't have scrapper. All right, let's see what we can do. it to 27 yeah that's worth it uh, can I do I have any sites that I can put on there no not really yeah I don't have enough nuclear material what about the barrel okay short barrel Okay. I'm sorry. Uh, my wife is... God. <laughs> oh my god. Um, uh, Grips. Comfort grip. No material. Eh. <laughs> yeah, I don't really don't want to burn my oil just for that. All right. Here we go. Off to Concord. We're gonna conquer. Conquered. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'll take myself out back and flagellate. <laughs> yeah, pretty soon I'm going to take long, Lone Wanderer and I'll get rid of the, the dog. I don't like companions. Never have, never will. Let's see what we can do with this new pistol here. Hey! Better. Better. Alright. Yeah, gun nut is so important. Okay. I think those give acid. I'm not gonna... Uh, loop this right now. I'm going to focus on pushing the story. I wonder what's happening over there. What could it be? <laughs> I've done this so many times. I love this game. Mm. These new textures are nice. Yeah. Okay. 45. Short. There we go. That pipe revolver, man. That thing is so good. Let's see here. Alright, we're kind of at the extreme range of pistols here. Nice shot. All right. I did good. <laughs> I know. Don't break your back patting yourself on the back, right? Break your arm. Oh, wow. Nice. Okay, so now 
I need to take a long, hard look at what we're gonna... Okay. We're gonna start to specialize in rifles. Uh, let's see. That's always good. Um, we won't have silence weapons for a while. Um, let me see. Bloody mess is good. It's plus five percent to damage. It's just right across the top. Um, yeah, we're gonna start working on that. We'll keep we'll keep dog meat for now. Nope. Got a double? Here we go. Okay, what all we got in here? Yep. Yeah, that thing is awesome. But we've only got six rounds for it. Alright, so what we need to do... Right... Uh, that's a pipe auto pistol. Let's see... Alright, let's take a look at our apparel here. Alright, now we're starting to get... So that's 5.7. We can go here. Is that 2 2? Two, 2 5? Okay. Raider Leathers. Now yeah, I'll go with Army Fatigues. Um, sack Hood. It's going to look stupid, but. Hmm. Oh, we can't. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if there's anything in here. Yeah, there is stuff in here we want. That's we definitely want that adhesive, big time. I was kind of hoping for a little bit more. Yeah, the fuses are good and they're light. Those light bulbs are light, too. Okay. Alright. Up, up, up we go. Uh -huh. Oh, there's some chems. I do miss chem resistant. I also miss my... my acrobat's armor. Okay, so here's the shotgun, and here's the, let's see, so what you can do is you can double charge it like that, which is not bad at all. Do you there, pal? No more British occupation. I wish this game had a a peep function like you can do in other games. You hear and you. Oh yeah, there it goes. Okay, I thought it had it. Yeah. You were saying? I'd better heal. That kind of hurt. Okay, some bubble gum. Did I reload? Okay, I did. 
Something I can put on. Uh, see. It's a red arm. There we go. Right arm. All right, we're four nine. Look at that armor factor. <laughs> Itched and I reached up and bumped my microphone. I'm not used to my microphone being there. Okay, we need to get the. F There's a fusion core in here. We need to go ahead and try to get. God damn. Good stuff, good stuff. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna pick this. Oh! Shit! That was dumb. Don't go breaking off God. bobby pins, dummy. Yeah, so part of the main quest, you'll have to come back here and get that anyway, so... Might as well get it now. Uh, there's... Probably some. I think there's some loot in here. Yep, yep. 38. Thank you, thank you. I don't think there's anybody. Oh, yeah, I was just down here. Dummy. I just came through there. Hmm. What's that? That's cement. I want that. Hmm? All right. Get some psycho. What we got? Hmm. Tablespoon. Cigarette carton. Those are good. You can make some some money early on with that stuff. I may have... Did I get all the... The baddies? I may have... No, no, there's... Nope, there's a few more. Yeah, right in there. Oh, fans. Desk fans are always good to pick up. Leather chest piece. There we go. Okay, let's see how we're doing here. Excellent. We're starting to actually get some armor factor here. Let's see here. I think you can jump this. Okay, you can't. Son of a bitch. Can't I pick this? Oh, it's advanced. Yeah, I'll break too many. Alright, let's not... Representation. <laughs> All right. Okay. Upper skull. That's good. Switchblade. I don't need. All right. Bad guys are in here. Let's just get the hell out of here. We got no reason to hang around and get shot. It's a fucking pansy. We hold out for the. I'll find you. Damn it. Hmm. Oh, that didn't go very well. It's 
Sorry about that dog meat. <laughs> hmm. Leather left arm. Let's see how that looks in terms of apparel. That's exactly the same. <laughs> Well, almost to the end. Let's go ahead and top off here with the... <coughs> oh. Okay, how about a wild mutt fruit then? Yeah. Cola? Light him up. Yeah. We'll do something, dog meat. Don't just See here. Yeah, we're getting pretty heavy here. Let's go like that. Okay. Alright, what we got? Let's get some of this loot. I <laughs> see that. I keep wanting to break it down like I'm like I'm playing uh the zombie game. Seven days to die. Good game. Do 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 Nothing else. Hmm. Anything? Oh yeah, I was just in there. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's save. Preston Garvey. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minimum. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. Mm-hmm. God damn it. Huh. Copy Please, Nicole. go on. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First, it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Sorry. Sounds rough. Thanks. It's good to meet someone who really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Ah, uh, that ain't it. Let's hear it. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. Pre-war. You might have seen it. <coughs> well... Looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrate. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? <laughs> minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. <laughs> the suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. Mm-hmm. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. <laughs> A nuclear battery. <laughs> but we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the oh basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. 
Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Maybe. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, mm -hmm. those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Okay. Yeah, so when you come through here. Hell yeah. Sure to grab that. Oh, did I ever. Did I forget to grab that grognak back over the other place? I think I did. Yeah, so loot up. I don't really. F I don't need that stuff. <laughs> and get the bubblehead. Oh, military grade. Awesome. We need that. I don't think we need any of that. There's the Vertibird's engine. And in we go. Now. You have to be kind of careful here. If you don't know, <clears throat> this battle isn't what it appears to be. <laughs> so we'll put the fusion core in. Get in our first suit of power armor. We'll have dozens by the time the game's over. You gotta be careful here because you're gonna be tempted to stand here. We got somebody up here. Show me that fancy gun up close. A lot of people can get past my boys. Give me that. Gotta go. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and reload. Yeah, there's a death claw. And you don't want to fight him out in the open, he will shred you. Come here, death claw. He'll just get killed out there. Let's see here. Where's he at? Come here. Over here. Come on. Come here. out you can see the son of a bitch is tough okay come on back here Where'd he go? <laughs> Come back, your death claw. <laughs> yeah.
Just about. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Gotcha. Alright. Okay, hey. boy. Come on. Alright. There we go. Okay. Hmm. And our power armor didn't get completely annihilated. Yeah. Excuse me. That was a pretty amazing display. I know, right? I'm just glad you're on our side. You should be. You guys going to be okay now? Yeah. For a while, anyway. We can at least move some. Listen. When we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here. Yeah. It ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. Okay. So we got some stiff. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, oh, yeah? maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled. You're there. coming to Sanctuary with me. <laughs> Wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. And I know your pain. Okay. I'm listening. You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Bullshit. You're trying to play me for a fool. <laughs> oh, no, kid. No. The sight's sometimes foggy, but it ain't ever a liar. Your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. That's... Look, kid, I'm and that's what we'll do in the next episode. Let's go to Diamond City. Some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No, Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here. It's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now <laughs> you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? it? Oh, hold, hold on, hold on. Worse than Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? <laughs> Anybody? <laughs> Sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh, okay. Let's make sure we've placed up all the the good loot that's around here. Let's see, right behind you, boss. Some road leathers. Yeah, we're gonna need some some equipment for them. Okay. I can't believe you can't believe it. I'm a bad motherfucker. <laughs> Let's see, probably need that. What's this? Okay. Uh, 
that. Gotta be careful. Okay. Oh, sport hunting rifle. Awesome. Alright, how are we doing for weight? Oh yeah, we're getting... That's awfully heavy. Uh, that's fine. Settlers. Okay, so now what I do once I'm pretty sure. Oh. Okay, did I get all the loot? Yeah. Is there a. Yep, Nuka Cola. Okay, I fast travel back and then wait. fusion core in there unless you want your settlers to take it okay um so let's let's hit the hay for one hour and they should be here there we go all right and now he'll give us the quest to I'm set up the settlement come with us I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. <laughs> I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Maybe. I woke up at one point. Some people killed my wife and kidnapped my son. Those bastards. I'm trying to find Damn. him. Oh, okay. Sorry. Mm. I hope you find him. Kind of getting a crick in my neck here. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, anyway. I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind. But I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? <laughs> I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The Minutemen could use more people like you. Hey. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. <laughs> okay, so let's level. Okay, first things first. Let's get rid of dog meat so we can get our lone wanderer buff. In order to do that, we need to store that and store that. Okay. So then go talk to let's level up okay all right hmm. that's good advanced locks is a good idea um okay we can't take that let's see extra sneak is a good idea can't do more gun nut for a while. Hmm. 
I'm leaning towards Gunslinger. We don't have armor yet. We need the strength. Oh, the strength bobblehead. I know where that is. I forgot how difficult that was to get. Hmm. Maybe I should have raised strength. Oh well, too late now. Um. Yeah, let's let's get in the better, better, uh, safe and whatnot. Because I don't think we're quite ready to put away the the ten millimeter pistol. You willing to do some work? Uh huh. I'd be glad to help. Just tell me what you need. Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. <laughs> Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. I'm on it. Clean water coming up. <laughs> Great. Thanks again. Hmm. Didn't realize they, they needed that much water. Hmm, okay. I don't think I can build power yet. Can I? I've got two oil. Hmm. Hmm, maybe I can. I didn't think I had enough stuff. Right, that's gonna give us five. I forgot what this thing needs. It needs two. Okay, so we're good. This is your most efficient power generator. And there we go. Now see, the problem is our defense is so low. That's what scares me. And that can get you attacked. So you want your defense to be double your food and water. So, 46. And obviously, we don't have 46. Uh, let me see. How you do you to go to Why sanctuary? Okay, he'll he'll stay here. Let's go talk to Sturgis. Sturgis. And then I'm gonna shut this down. I feel better already. Knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. Oh, yeah. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help, but our food supplies are running low. Yeah, if we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. <laughs> okay. I just want to trade a few things. God, I hate her. Okay. And let's see. Hmm. Oh wow, I got thirty-five rounds. Okay. So we'll give her a right arm. And we'll give her Raider Leathers. Give her a left arm, a left leg. Okay, she's so she needs a right leg. Hey, I got a right leg. Yeah. I genuinely despise her, but what are you gonna do? Oh, she's assigned to food. Okay, so she already picked it up. Nothing I hate more than raider scumbags. If you run into any, put a Hey Sturgis. Well, this place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with it. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. I know. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. 
I'm on it. Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. <laughs> Sturgis. Thanks for doing that. We'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Home. Feels good. I was glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door is always open to you. Windows, too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. Oh, almost leveled. Let me give him some better gear. Ah, stupid animation. I'd like to trade some items. All right, let's give him a Molotov cocktail. I've seen people warn you not to give them. I think they're, I think they're incredibly wrong. Uh, okay, leather right arm. Okay, leather right leg. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I think you, you all of your settlers should have either a frag grenade or a Molotov cocktail. Okay, I think that's it. I don't think we can, yeah, we can't give her anything. And I don't think we can give Preston anything. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to put my extra armor in here. That's a 2-5, that's a 2-2, two, two. okay. Raider right leg. What am I wearing? Hmm. Yeah, I know how to fast travel game, thank you. Uh, let me see. Yeah, right leg. There we go. Ooh. We're at 921. <laughs> Leather right arm. Let me see. That's a 1-3. That's a 1. What's the difference? I don't get it. Oh, leather right arm. 1-1. One, one. Oh, yeah, that is better. Okay. Alright. So we'll do this. And we'll put that up. That'll be for future um, folks. And guys, I think that's gonna do it for now. I need to do some. I'm gonna do some um, cleaning up and stuff. But that's the majority of getting set up in sanctuary. It's a good start. I yeah, we've we're almost sixth level, I think. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.